Over the years, Maryland's legislature has rejected several attempts to approve gay marriage in the state, but a potential ruling by the attorney general could bring that issue back into play. Charles Robinson has our story. By the power and authority vested by law and me as clerk of the court for Anne Arundel County, Maryland, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Congratulations. You may kiss your bride. I'd like to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Charles Booker. We Feel both nice uh, work together. It's actually we met, so I guess home, yeah, they say home is where the heart is, so. If the bookers decide they want to leave the state, their license will be recognized all across the country. But if you happen to be gay, that won't be the case here in Maryland. That's important for delegate Heather Mazura. She and her partner Deborah were married in California. They are anxiously awaiting the ruling from the attorney general their marriage will be recognized by the state. If somebody has been legally married in another state and then moves to Maryland, are we saying to gay and lesbian couples that are legally married that we don't ever want them or their tax dollars to move to Maryland? Because if we don't recognize their marriage if they move to Maryland, they're never going to come to our state. If Maryland recognizes same-sex unions from outside of the state, there will be concern. It's bad social policy, it's bad political policy, it's bad educational policy, and uh, it's bad economic policy. What makes my bill urgent is that uh, Washington, D.C. Uh, has approved same-sex marriages, and as soon as those marriages are performed, you don't get in closer to Maryland than Washington, D.C. All those people are going to be coming over here wanting us to accept their marriage. The cliche goes, politics often makes for strange bedfellows. And on this issue, a Democrat will likely get support from Republicans. I think it's a backdoor way to bring gay marriage in. The Attorney General's on record as saying that he supports gay marriage. He believes the law should be changed. And I think he's um, uh, basically overstepping his authority. Legislators who thought this issue was settled may be drawn back in to this contentious debate. I'm Charles Robinson for State Circle.